Kus Mua Kirsenta Kati. This is my story of how I accepted my disability. I was able to adapt to the new physical, emotional, and spiritual changes. For 25 years of my life, I was able to grasp life with both hands. Then suddenly, I was forced to hold on with one. I encountered simple everyday tasks with frustration, anger, and sadness. I took my life for granted. Tying my own shoes became a challenge. Driving a standard vehicle was not an option. My spirit was broken. I felt lost, ashamed, and incapable of living a normal life due to my physical limitation, but I refused to be limited. I challenged myself to find new ways to master simple daily tasks. The loss of my arm prevented me from feeling accepted, looked up to, and upholding my cultural responsibilities. I traveled an emotional roller coaster of pain, shame, and guilt through the stages of grief. Through the beat of the drum, a new sound reverberated and healed my broken spirit, healed my mind, mended my heart, and renewed my soul. Through singing powwow, I felt a new sense of belonging. I was found through spirituality, through the songs. Through my depression, I coped with accepting my self-image by abusing alcohol and illegal substances. I found comfort and the ease of pain through self-medication. I realized that a life cannot move forward without change. I began my journey eight years ago. Sobriety became a new way of life. I began to reshape my new independent self by finding work, having attained an associate's degree of applied science in network engineering, and recently being able to participate in my Hopi cultural ceremonies. Today, I continue to live a life of harmony and balance through the sharing of my story. Ovi uma nava